Okay guys, I now want to look at what we could have asked you instead of asking you just to move the point 5. Okay, if we said what is the e new equation of the exponential curve, so this is an extension question on question C. Okay, I'm just going to put the EXT for extension. We could have said what is the new equation of, I'm going to try and write shorthand, of f under the transformation that you've performed in C, okay, that you did in C. Okay, so what do we have? We have f of x is twice a half to the power of x plus 1 plus 3. If we translate that graph 5 units downward, it would mean that our y, our shift is in the y's. So we are going to go down 5, which means this has a minus 5 connected to it. So now the curve becomes f of x minus 5 to make use of that transformation. Okay, so this will be twice. It does not affect the x but it does affect the y value. So this will be plus 3 minus 5, uh, which then gives you a minus 2. But now the important part. If we move this graph one unit to the right, okay, what are we going to do in that equation? So we have the following. Let's have a look. I have f of x minus 5 with a vertical translation. So in the horizontal translation, I am now going to take my x, do something with it. So that is what I've got. I am going to, because I'm moving one unit to the right, I'm going to take all the x's and subtract one from them. Remember, horizontal translations, you do the opposite of what it says in your head you should be doing. Okay, so if you move to the right one unit, you subtract one with the x's. So this will be f of x minus 1 minus 5. So that will then become 2 times a half x minus 1 plus 1 is x minus 2. So under that transformation, you have the equation of your new graph.